All right, you may have seen. Recently, I made the mozzarella and meatball, like, Rhodes Rolls Bombs. We ate the whole thing that afternoon. It was amazing. So, I'm making another pan of that. And, because this one, the other one got eaten so fast, I made a whole pan of just the meatballs. And then a whole pan of the other requested one was pepperoni pizza ones. So... Under, there's 12 Rhodes rolls in this pan and 12 in this one. So there's 12 meatballs, every one. And then on this, instead of one pepperoni, I put two pepperonis on each one because I was too lazy to cut them up. So it's quick and easy. So these beauties are going to go into the oven for a little meal prep. All right, just like that. 15 minutes in the oven. And they are, look at that, just beautiful. So when you're making them, you don't put much sauce in there. So you can always... Like, I had sauce to dip them in on the side, but nobody even did it. They just ate it just like that with a little bit of sauce. I cranked on there a ton of Italian seasonings and parsley. And uh, here we go. I'm just going to let them cool for a while. And then what I do is I cut them all apart. And then I bag up, or I cut like two apart. Um, and then they can have two plus the other side dishes and fruits and such like that. But, uh, uh it's that's how it goes. That's a big meal prep real quick. There's one simple meal and something that pleases everybody. All right, before we tackle this, they're finally cool. I'm going to mix up myself some iced coffee. Um, I like mostly coffee and then just a splash of this. But this blueberry cobbler, you guys, creamer from Walmart is so good with vanilla coffee. I don't love it with chocolate or like the mocha and stuff, but this vanilla one is really good. So we're going to pour some coffee. And then start prepping that and see what else I get up to once I'm done with that. That shouldn't take long. All right. I'll show you an update. I got three, six, eight cups of cottage cheese. These are a nice, good serving size. Like, for the meal prep, they can have two sliders and a tub of cottage cheese and fruit or something. And that is plenty. So I got those done. I still have half of this giant tub left. But I'm working on pineapple. Madison wanted little totes of pineapple. I didn't realize, but she got pineapple slices, which is fine. We'll make it work. But she wanted to make her own refresher. So she asked me to save the juice. And she's going to use pineapple juice and the vanilla coconut milk. So like the Starbucks one uses the crayon strawberry one. It makes a great drink. So she got inspired. And she's going to use that. She'll probably only use half of that. But I put it in a nice mason jar so she can just put it in the fridge. And make herself another one later tomorrow. This stuff's mean. Alright, that big can was enough for four totes of pineapple sides. So we'll get that in the fridge. Sis, how's your drink? Yummy. Yummy? Yes. Awesome. That's her pineapple and coconut milk. We're getting dishes put away. You guys, I got a mess. I've been meal prepping, splitting up boxes of Q-tips. I got a lot going on. We got dishes getting put away. It's a busy evening here in our kitchen. Yes, Pete? There's Pete. All right, while I'm on a roll, the kids had a request. So I make um, like a Parmesan garlic buttery pasta with meatballs that they really like. So they were requested that. So far I just have one tub of butter, or one tub with one stick of butter. And I put in a hefty amount of garlic, Italian seasoning, parsley flakes, and then this I didn't put in there because there's not enough room. But I have a whole pound of pasta going here on the stove. And then when this is done, I will just pour a bag of frozen meatballs that are pre-cooked and they will thaw overnight and then when they go to eat them tomorrow they'll just warm it all up and that will be nice easy and another crowd favorite so we'll show you when we get that all put together all right walmart i got a bone to pick with you so family size great value Ita italian style meatballs right 80 ounces family size this bag is almost gone, so we bought another bag a different time, like a week or two later. Family size, Italian style meatballs, 48 ounces. 80, so what family, which family needs an 80 ounce, but then decides maybe we'll only make it about half that. How annoying. <laughs> so it's almost half the amount of meatballs for the same family size package of meatballs. Everything's the same. That's super annoying. And I'm sure the price is more, but that's a little frustrating. But anyway, keep rambling. I'm going to get some of these little meal totes out 
And I'm gonna go ahead and put some meatballs in there while I wait for the noodles to cook. So at least I can keep rolling along instead of sitting around waiting for pasta to boil. All right, look at these luscious, well, luscious noodles. I left a little bit of the pasta water in there. One whole pound of pasta and all the seasonings I showed you. And I let it cook down just a little bit longer. And I dumped like almost a cup of Parmesan cheese in here. And just a sprinkle of salt because I didn't put that in at all before. And now what I'm going to do is... Let's see if I can get one that's easier to see and put in. I'm going to fill the rest of these totes with pasta. So there is that. I have, I think I have 12 containers that I think I'm going to try to squeeze a pound of pasta in. So we'll see how it goes. Guys, I'm meal prepping like a boss today. All right, it worked out. I have nine totes that are a little more full for the kids. And then I made three smaller ones for like Jake and I to share that have less pasta because we can't eat as much as them. So these ones have just a little bit less pasta, but still have three meatballs because the protein, you know, is important. So those are going into the fridge and I'll show you the fridge drawer that I stock up for them. Hope, try to do it weekly, but let's uh, show you what we got going in there. Hey mom, look it. Hang on one second, sis. All right, so here is the fresh stocked up kid pull-out drawer in the fridge. We've got pineapple, plenty of cottage cheese, the meatball and pizza little bomb slider bombs, the pasta and meatballs, yogurt is another popular choice around here. So that is the easy like mom cooked prepped except for yogurts obviously those are no brainer. <laughs> 